Verlanda Gothenburg home to Grenoble in the Group G finale for both teams. Verlanda in the hunt for top spot. Grenoble out of the playoff mix, but trying to rebound from a 10-2 loss in the matchup last week. Doesn't look good early. Ryan Lash with the blast. The CHL top scorer on the board, 78 seconds in. Fourth of the competition for Lash, who is just getting started. Home team doesn't waste any time doubling the lead. Joel Ratkovich Bernson fires one past Raphael Garnier, 2-0, less than two and a half minutes in. Ratkovich Bernson free to fire and does. Not quite five minutes from the opening faceoff. Three zip for Olanda, but Terry Lindboom sets up Lash, and it looks like another long night for the French champions. Great awareness by Lindboom. Easy work for Lash, who would end up with five points in the game. Rolanda given too much room to operate early on. They take full advantage. This time, Max Freeberg to Radan Lentz. The four-time CHL champs lead it by four with 53 minutes of hockey to go. Could they top that 10-2 route? Well, Grenoble would have something to say about that. Flavian Dare whips it by Lars Johansson. It's 4-1. Brent Alban with a face-off win to set it up. But a power play paved the way for Frolanda to extend the lead to 4 once more, and they pounce. Patient puck movement pulls the defense out of position and watch for Nicholas Lasu, number 31, right there. Lasu on the man advantage, 5-1 in period one. Fans are loving it. Frolanda on its way to another comfortable win, or were they? Let's get to the second. Just over four minutes in, the Grenoble forecheck wins possession. Julian Munoz puts it away. It's 5-2. Munoz with the nice redirect on the feed from Marcus Pokola. It's a three-goal contest. Grenoble with a little bit of life to start the period. Less than two minutes on. More from the French side. Alban with a sweet feed to Flavian Dare. 5-3 on the second of the game from the 20-year-old. Good work to find the open ice. And there's more. Joel Champagne goes to the net. And he finds the rebound three straight for Grenoble, making it 5-4 for Olanda suddenly in a very different spot. Three goals in less than four minutes. It's game on. But for Olanda wasn't going to back down, and soon Philip Johansson restored a two-goal advantage. Quick release, deflected off a defender. No chance for Garnier. 6-4 for Olanda on top. They'd go to the third with that edge. Getting late in the contest, and Grenoble can't produce the miracle comeback. Instead, Yuri Inela cashes on the counter. It's 7-4. Frolanda made to work by Grenoble, but too much in the end. The Swedes win 5 of 6, and now need Ice Bear in Berlin to take something from Mountfield tomorrow to win the group.